thought I'd pick back up on a vlog for this week. I believe I am working from home all week because of coronavirus. So I thought I'd kind of do like a work from home vlog week. Patrick's also working from home all week. He's actually working from home until the 6th. My company hasn't really made any large announcements like that yet. So right now it is Sunday. I'm editing YouTube videos. I'm watching YouTube. Just kind of doing some like Sunday stuff. I really want to go to the gym, but I think I'm going to stop going to the gym for a little bit and just either going on walks or using booty bands and weights I have here for now just because I really want to flatten the curve. Um, also, I got a lot of books to read, <laughs> so I'll probably do that today. And then I might update you guys a little bit today, but I'll mostly just kind of do like a work week vlog. I'm doing an at-home workout with these bands. I have one on right now. They have different resistance, like different levels. I'm so out of breath. I've been doing jump squats, fire hydrants, kickbacks, squats, just like everything. So I'm really out of breath, but I'm trying to avoid the gym and do what I can in my apartment. And I know I look insane that I'm working out full makeup and lashes, but I literally just like started right away after I filmed a video. I'm even wearing the same top because <laughs> it's comfortable and like thin and everything. So I usually don't do this. I usually don't wear makeup to like the gym and work out, but I just didn't feel like taking it all off and then working out because I'm going to get in the shower right after. I hate when I fake tan and then my Apple Watch rubs it off on both sides. It looks so awful, but I always want to wear my Apple Watch, and I always want to be tan. So for some reason, I thought I couldn't eat Rice Krispie Treats. Like, I know they're Rice Krispies, so they're gluten-free, but I thought they, like, put something else in it to make these. No, they're gluten-free, so I bought these, and this is my second one today. So really thriving. I should have never brought these into the house. It's Monday morning. Gotta have caffeine. Working from home, gonna block my screen. What do you want to watch? YouTube? Whoops, I'm blocking it. YouTube it is. YouTube. Office? Hard to see. Okay. Hitting up Chick-fil-A. They're doing drive through only, which is preferred anyways. For some breakfast. They're blowing up a cow. I bet it's to say, like, we're still open. So excited for my food. Oh, let's try and get it up. I ate a chicken mini because I have nowhere to be. And that was my first chicken mini in a couple of years. And holy crap. People, they're just amazing that people can eat that multiple times a week. It's so heavenly and so good. Got extra sauce and got my hash browns. <laughs> mm. One of the best parts of working from home is streaming the morning toast on the big screen. I'm loving this. It's about 1 p.m. I made my raspberries, blackberries, and protein granola. And then I have my tea from earlier that I didn't drink because we went and got Chick-fil-A. So he's still here. Not working. We are going on a walk to maintain sanity as you work from home. Um, my work just said work from home until further notice, so that's good, I guess. So just wearing a gym shark set, and it's 52 degrees. So I think I'm actually going to put a sweater on over this as well. We went on a walk to get out of the house. <laughs> what are you bringing things with you? <laughs> don't worry, we don't actually live around here, so I'm not exposing where I live. <laughs> What is happening? <laughs> Things are going insane during the quarantine. We just woke up, so I guess I'll make my bed to be a civilized human. And we've just been working in the living room. Unless he takes a call, he takes a call in here. But I'm just gonna make my bed, make some tea, and get moving. We did a really crappy job. Honestly, we really need to wash our sheets. I'll probably do that tomorrow before I make the bed. Hopefully I remember. I'm honestly so hungry. I don't usually wake up starving, but... I'm gonna make something. On my list of things to do, my jade roller, my blue light glasses, a candle, my water, my tea, my laptop, and my husband. <laughs> that won't turn on the lights and wants us to use natural light. It's not the end of the world. It's time you gotta save that. Oh my god, we're fine. The post office so that my package wasn't delivered yet. 
Like, it still said out for delivery at, like, 10 p.m. And then it gave up and said it hadn't been delivered yet the next day. But I got it. I'm so excited. I'll show you guys what it looks like. These are the pairs. So, this is kind of like a 7th, 8th leggings. Oh, the material is so cool. And it has this. And then these are the ones I've really been wanting. I think they're the Geo Seamless. And I got both in a size small. Don't mind the mess. But these are the first ones. The Geo Seamless. Oh, my gosh. They're so cute. You can, like, kind of see the pattern. Not really, which I like. And again, these are small. The second pair, they're like so cool right there. And this material is like scuba material, really tight, like really sucks you in. So if you're not into that, <laughs> I think it's really sucking things in. That one was more flexible, which I actually kind of like more, but we'll see. On the model, these were short, like barely above her ankle, and these weren't, but they're longer here. <laughs> Like these kind of are shorter, which I don't love, but here's an overview of what they look like. These were the rest of my packages, really exciting. So sleeping gummies and then dusters, cause you know, like to keep a clean household over here. And we have the office on and the pantry's left open and I'm making tea. So I got like a teapot or two on my registry and I haven't, <laughs> it's still my parents, like a third of my wedding gifts. So I've been making the tea in here, which is kind of a pain in the butt. Um, but I put five of the Tezo Tazo green tea bags and then I put it in this plastic pitcher and I make iced tea with it. And we're doing some laundry, so we have some towels in here. It's so nice to work from home to get all these like little things done that I usually just kind of, there's more laundry in there, that I kind of want to do just on the weekend. We are on day two and we already want to kill each other. Day two of quarantine. <laughs> Oh, I'm also gonna gain the quarantine 15. It's begun. Our apartment gym is officially closed. So is my brother's in Fort Lauderdale. So is a lot of people. <laughs> oh, I hate this. I hate this so much. I like wanna go to Starbucks or Chick-fil-A to like get out of here. I do have a hair appointment Thursday, but I'm pretty sure it's still on because she has like her own, I think it's like a one chair salon situation because she moved from my large salon. So I think it's still on, which is great for me. And it's a lot better because now she's not at a salon that had like 40 chairs, so it's like safer and everything. Mm -hmm. And we are starting Shot of the Sunset from the very beginning. So this is what it has come to. Wow, they look so different. Work is over. I'm just watching some YouTube and then we're gonna go on a walk when he's done with his phone call. And then his parents need eggs. So we're gonna go get eggs from Costco for them because they're all out of eggs where they live. More Amazon packages. I got another pair of the Ritzy Lashes that I'm loving by Kiss. And then I got these, which I thought they were thicker because I have pretty thick hair. So I don't know. I'm gonna have to like double up on these, but these are pretty cheap as well. Here we are again. <laughs> I'm gonna get some wine, might as well, while we're here. Here, let's less people than I expected. I've never seen it actually this empty in my life. It's beautiful. It's so refreshing to leave the house. Ooh, what are those? I wish I could eat the lemon poppy seed one. Mm -hmm. Got eggs for his family. We are back. From Costco, we went on a walk. I did some abs, took a shower. I'm about to fake tan, but I actually am getting to watch the vlog. I was trying to watch. I have my glass of wine. I always put an ice cube in it to like help, like drink it slower and dilute it because I do get headaches from red wine sometimes. And I think we're gonna make eggs and bacon soon. My half of the eggs stuff is so good. Wow. Mm -hmm. So I just fake tan. I use the dripping gold one. I have a pebble patch thing going on right now. It's like the darkest tanner. I did not realize I had to eat like a giant eczema patch. Like I get eczema all over, but it's like, oh, can you see it? Look at that. Where it's like super dark and then it's like not taking the self tanner right here and then super dark patching right here. I hope I'm wash it gets better, but I don't think so. So it's like front and center. Oh, it looks so bad. And like when I do makeup, I can like drag it down my neck, but I wear tinted moisturizer, so there's not a lot I can do. But like of all places, like right there come on but i am fully equipped for the night to sleep in my tanner and we're watching heartbreakers right now which is what the morning toast assigned as the movie for today and then banner pump rules is on tonight oh my God, i think i have my keys for a second i'm like i don't have my keys <laughs> time for starbucks <laughs> 
Oh, I should probably unlock it for you. What do you get? A hot coffee. Good job. Since our jobs aren't affected, we want to keep pumping money into the economy so we get Starbucks. That's our excuse. That's our excuse. Yep, and I got a uh, venti ice cream tea the usual. Big tan fail. <laughs> Great. Beautiful. We went on a walk as our lunch break, and then I showered, and I just changed back into my pajamas. <laughs> I did fake tan last night. I honestly did a really crappy job. I showed you a clip earlier of my hands. Things are not looking good. I'm, like, patchy on my eczema and my neck. I showed you. Oh, you can, like... Yeah, things are going really well. But back in my pajamas, Patrick went to his parents' house. I don't really even know why. So I'm here alone. Hopefully I don't go crazy. And I still have like three or four hours of the workday left. A couple things I am taking right now that I don't, I should honestly take regularly is the vitamin C. Get these at Costco. And then I've been taking these zinc tablets to help with my immune system as well. And then I just have a normal hum probiotic, which is somewhere in there that I've been taking. Also, Patrick went to his parents to do some things at home and then to bring them the eggs we bought for Costco. And guess what? He's gone and the eggs are still here. So that's not good. And the work day is done. I'm babbage to his laptop. I'm at the point where like, do I film a YouTube video? Do I take a nap? Do I read? Do I have a glass of wine? Nobody knows. I gotta plug this in because it's dying. I don't know if I'm gonna do a YouTube video now. I was gonna film one tomorrow. I'm getting my hair done tomorrow as well. So, we'll see. I got some roots. Got some roots kicking in, so I'm getting highlights. And I'm actually gonna cut my hair maybe a couple inches, which is like really big for me. Okay, a decision has been made. I pour myself a glass of wine, Oyster Bay Sauvignon Blanc from Costco, and I'm going to film a video. I'm gonna do a makeup, I've forgotten about, video tutorial situation and review products. If I still like them, if I'm glad I don't use them anymore, yada yada, yeah. And we are done with the video. It is a hot mess. I moved my lighting, had a glass of wine with it. Gotta clean all this up now. And this is the look I created. These eyelashes are way too big for my face, but I did like a look of makeup I've forgotten about or I used to love, I haven't used in a while. So actually like I love this look. I did a cut crease and I absolutely love how it turned out. I'm just going straight into editing because we I have nothing else to do. I'm about to make dinner. There's a glare from my blinds and the light out there. There you go. So I'm editing. I just used the iMovie on my Mac and then I'm watching some YouTube right now. And then I'm gonna go ahead. I think I'm gonna make a pizza right now. Gonna make pizza. I like to have a pizza like once a week because it's not that great for you. So I'm gonna put stone and it's about 607. Go ahead and preheat the oven. It's gluten-free pizza. It says to do it on 425, but sometimes I notice with the gluten-free dough, it's hard to like really get it crispy and normal. So I just kind of put it up five degrees. Like that's really gonna do anything. And then I'll take you guys to the freezer. And then I just get this Trader Joe's. <laughs> Cheese pizza, it's gluten free with cauliflower crust. Quarantine 15, here I come. I'm obviously gonna split this with Patrick, it's not all mine. And some Chick fil A ranch to dip it in. Watching the Housewives, New Jersey. This is part three of the reunion. So excited, trying to edit. This has failed six times now, six times. I don't think I have a lot of storage left on here. I got a couple years ago before I did YouTube, and like, I wish I got more storage. And the fact that they have Danielle on here, I just, I can't. She needs to not be on here. That's absurd. Anyways, so lucky number seven. Bringing you wine, enjoying Real Housewives together. His favorite jersey. I'm on my way to my hair appointment. It is a one chair salon, so it's totally fine to go in. And we're doing highlights and a cut. I think I'm actually going to cut a few inches off, which is like really big for me. So I'll see you guys after. Progress. I have my color in under some heat, and then we're gonna wash it, dry it, and do the cutting. Well, I'll probably cut it wet, but again. I'm back. I cut off like a lot, a lot. I just feel like it needed it. I hate cutting my hair, but I think I cut like three or four inches off, and I got some highlights. So there you go. I love it. I'm happy I cut it. I think it looks so good, and the color looks amazing.
just sitting here doing work. Patrick is at his parents again because he forgot those eggs. So I swear his parents probably think that I'm driving him crazy during this quarantine that like he wants to get away from me. But really he's like going there to do like work stuff and then he forgot the eggs so he has to go back, blah, blah, blah. He shouldn't be leaving me tomorrow. Tomorrow's Friday. I'll probably wrap up the blog on blog vlog on Friday. But right now it's Thursday at four. I'm just doing a little more work, watching some YouTube in the background. And then I need to walk to the grocery store to get fruit. And then I want to bake something because her eggs are about to expire. And this thing needs like five eggs. So I'm going to bake something real quickly tonight as well. I experienced my first dilemma today. I went to the grocery store and there was no eggs and no almond milk. So that's the first time and last like two weeks that I've actually had an issue getting something. So I'm gonna go to another Publix and hopefully get that because I'm trying to bake. So allergy season is in full swing. The tree pollen is like what bothers me the most, I think. And the inhaler I've been using is expired. And I was like, this probably isn't good for me. Like I should really get one. So I called my doctor and they said they haven't seen me within the last year. So I have to go into the hospital. That's where my doctor is to get a new inhaler. And I'm like, are you sure? Like you can't just like call it in, please. I don't wanna come in. So tomorrow morning, going to the doctors, it, but it's gonna be like a 10 minute thing. Like I just need the normal inhaler. I've had this one for five years, not thrilled. I have to put my hair for a walk. I guess I should like move this. Oh my God, my ponytail is so tiny. I can't get over how much hair I actually cut off. It had to be like more than four inches, like maybe five or six, but it's such a little baby ponytail, but I love it. It looks so pretty. And then Nordstrom's clothes. We have a live performance by Patrick Dowd. Right, ready? Here we go. Oh yeah. Let's start with the H chord of my homes, my homes, <laughs> my lovely lady homes. Oh. Oh. Well, this is what day like eight of our quarantine. <laughs> Things are heading south. We're losing sanity. Ooh, I think we need to tune that though. Oh. You go, girl. Sure, sure. We just got back from our walk and we haven't had dinner yet and I just kind of want to relax. So this is what I was going to bake. I'm going to bake it tomorrow instead and then I might just make frozen chicken fingers because we're just not feeling it right now. Time to go to the doctor's office. Hopefully it'll be super quick. I'm wearing this crop top from Target, Gymshark leggings, Air Force Ones. I have crap everywhere. I kind of just like woke up. I'm going to go. And then I have a bomber jacket because it's kind of cool out. And then hopefully it's like 15 minutes. I get my prescription. I'm out. I'm back here working. Who gets diagnosed with asthma at age 25? Let me know. I have to go to a pulmonologist to get more tests. But she said it sounds like I have asthma. So that's really just something. I'm trying to give these flowers sun to come back to life. But I don't think it's going to happen. <coughs> new Gymshark came in. These are so cute. They are so soft. Then I got this bra that's really cool at the top. This goes like on the side the strap goes on so it looks really cute. It's super super supportive. And then I already own this. So large, large, and a small. Let's see. Dreamy mesh leggings. Ultra seamless sports bra. And energy seamless sports bra and then we're going on our walk and I'm trying this crop top it's what I wore to the uh, doctors except different shoes got our groceries got our milk he got this he wants a quarantine without it and we're walking home time to make these I'm gonna do my muffin form you just need eggs oil water ignore this random pan so I could preheat to 400 mix everything and then get her done Then we're putting another layer over the batter and then we're gonna put the rest of the cinnamon on top. So it's batter, cinnamon, batter, cinnamon. So those have the batter on top and they'll put more cinnamon and then we'll put them in the oven. They're ready to go in the oven. Just to make them prettier. Oh, you pushed them so far back. I didn't know you can pull the rack out. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, it's like everywhere. <laughs> I wanna scoop this it up. looks good. And then we have some more cinnamon that we're gonna probably sprinkle on top. 
So we're cooking chicken, watching the nanny right now. I'm gonna wrap up this week's vlog. This is like day 10 of our quarantine, just going to the grocery store walks here. I know it's been a really exciting vlog of um, sitting on the sofa for 12 hours a day and going on the same walk. Um, but please subscribe if you haven't already and give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next video.